COVID, COVID gone. What's happening? Well, it looks like they're retracting or they're walking back the fourth wave. What am I talking about? The COVID fourth wave. They've walked back the Delta variant completely. It's in the shadows. Well, the Delta variant still exists in Australia. Let's make that real clear here. It's still in Australia. Okay, we read it yesterday in an article. So what's going on? It's COVID, COVID gone. Fourth wave of COVID-19 no longer growing. Cases could decline in coming weeks. P-H-A-C. Good, these empty hospitals won't have to worry anymore about being more empty. The fourth wave of COVID-19 pandemic appear appears to have leveled off across Canada, according to officials from the Public Health Agency of Canada, though they warn that public health measures need to be maintained in order to keep COVID-19 cases at bay. So it's disappearing. <sighs> Just like the Lombada variant and the, <laughs> and the Delta May they rest in peace. But they're gone. They walked the ship back. <laughs> well, what's going on here? New modeling presented by the PHAC on Friday suggests that if current transmission levels are maintained, the number of new daily cases could decline in coming weeks. Progress hasn't been uh, pro uh, progress hasn't been even across Canada. Officials say. But overall numbers give reason for optimism, Dr. Teresa Tam, Chief Public Health Officer uh, of Canada, said. With levels of the vaccine coverage that we have achieved in Canada to date, we are much better protected going in into the respiratory infection season. Oh my god, we're going into flu season and they're backing out. Woo! And today's modeling update shows that by maintaining basic and less restrictive measures such as masking and limited close contact, we could reduce the impact of COVID-19 this winter. So it looks like they could actually, yeah. So what else is happening in Canada? Termination turmoil as workplace COVID-19 mandates take up. We've had several people call into the show. Several people are getting terminated and several people that have emailed me are getting terminated from their jobs. So they're going to have to figure something out with lack of immigrant, like a lack of qualified immigration coming into Canada. Remember, Canada closed immigration from uh, Europe in 1993. Yeah. And then they shut themselves in the foot and then they brought in a bunch of Portuguese construction workers in 2000 and then they deported everybody in 2007 so i mean it's kind of weird how it takes place but it's it's yeah so there it is canada is facing a potential wave of terminations tied to mandatory workplace vaccine policies as a growing number of employers require workers to be fully vac inoculated against covid19 or risk losing their jobs the other article said the fourth wave is disappearing. Is there is there really a fourth wave? That's the question we need to ask. And fact check. Oh, look at this. No, natural immunity doesn't replace vaccination. Experts say, of course it doesn't. How the the vaccine company is going to make money and the shareholders going to make money? Natural immunity will not protect you against COVID nineteen as well as the m as well as mRNA vaccine, according to both experts and research. So at least they're telling you it's a gene therapy vaccine. Multiple anti-vaccine groups touted nat natural immunity as as a viable alternative to getting vaccinated, but experts say that natural immunity is unreliable, especially when there's a safe and effective vaccine out. Again, what about all the Chinese investors buying property in 2020? Rampant. Look at the housing prices in Canada in 2020. Taken off rampant through the roof. They weren't checked. They weren't even checked for immunity or anything. They weren't even checked for vaccine. There wasn't even vaccine when they were coming in and buying us out. Look it up. $41 billion was brought into Canada through Hong Kong. That's just in one year. $41 billion into our real estate. Most of it trickled into our real estate market, right? So how do you... How do these, were these people? No, a lot of them weren't. I know people on the tarmacs and they tell me, yeah, for some reason, when you get planes in from certain countries, they just walk right into the country. There's no problems. So, yeah, it's kind of a one thing. But then but then you got people coming in from Haiti who across the U.S. border, three to 6,000 a week uh, coming in, mixed with other migrants from other countries. And these coming from countries with less than three hospitals functioning no and, and no vaccine and no masks. So how was there not a cluster F at the border? I told that to somebody yesterday and they laughed at me. They left, you're so delusional, Mike. There's nobody at the U.S. border. Biden secured the border. What are you talking about, Mike? I showed them photos, and they're like, oh, those are all doctored. 
I'm not making this up. I was like, okay. And we had our call from Norway the other day, and he told us that everything's back to normal, and they don't need they're they're treating it as the flu. So Finland follows other Nordic countries by suspending the Moderna COVID-19 vaccine. So yeah, there it is right there. Uh, Finland has joined other Nordic countries in suspending or discouraging the use of Moderna's COVID-19 vaccine in certain age groups because of an increased risk of heart inflammation, a rare side effect associated with the shot. So there it is right there, folks. I'm kind of throwing this out because COVID might be leaving soon. It's not working anymore. It's falling apart like a house of cards. What's next? Where are they going to guide us? Where is the, you know, anyways, guys, I'm putting away orders at the store. Guys, if you want to support this transmission, please buy something on my online store, mtg.toys, Merit Toys and Games, mtg.toys. We got a ton of board games. Christmas is on its way. Sit back, relax, play a few games. I got my new lamp in, by the way. And go ahead and uh, support us that way, mtg.toys. We ship to Canada and all over the United States. Thank you so much for watching. God bless. Be safe. Mike Martin's here. Co -co COVID away. I have spoken.